We're going to take a little break from all the thank yous now to talk about the most person, the most important person here today, my beautiful wife. I've got to say, I love the sound of that, and it feels so good to be finally able to say it. My wife, you know, it's, it's a brilliant, brilliant feeling. It didn't take me long to realise that me and Lisa were perfect for each other and that I wanted to spend the rest of my life by her side. There's a saying I recited to her on the day that I proposed, which is that life's not about finding someone you can live with, but instead finding that someone that you can't live without. And I definitely found that person in Lisa. When she came through the doors at the church today, I couldn't help but think to myself, well, yeah, she must be in the wrong place. There's no way that a vision like that could be walking up to stand next to me. But she did, and now she stands here as my wife, so thank you for that. I do realise I got the better end of the deal here, um, but I'll, I'll do all I can to make you happy. And, and to be the loving husband that you do truly deserve. Actually, the vicar did start the story about the first date that I took Lisa on. Um, it was out on the motorbike, so uh, what he didn't know is that I had to kit her out first. So we went into the garage and I put her in my mum's leather jacket, which had the tassels coming off the sleeves and everything and her boots and stuff. Um, so we went out on the bike, it was a gorgeous day. So we went out through Woolacombe, Saunton, up over the moors and then down to Hen's Mouth. It's got to be one of my favourite places, especially with taking Lisa down there on our first date down there. So we just, we sat there watching the waves rolling in, listening to some tunes on our phone, didn't we? Just getting to know each other really, wouldn't it? And uh, when the time started getting on a little bit, but we better start making a move. So we took a walk back up to the pub back up to the Hunters Inn. It was at the moment when we got to Hunters Inn, we're sat there, sort of had such a lovely day together, sun shining, that I realised, you know, this was the lady that, you know, I'm going to spend the rest of my life with, you know, and I'm glad I've got that chance. Since that day, you know, our love and friendship for each other has just grown and grown. And uh, I can honestly say I feel like the luckiest man alive today because not only have I married this beautiful woman, but I've married my best friend. And uh, I honestly mean that. Uh, 